to a brand new edition of Matt's Vlogs. Um, I've just realised, I've just filmed an entire five minute video and not realised that the camera was the wrong way around. So I've had to restart it. So what am I doing this morning? It's Monday, the last Monday in uh, June. Um, I'm literally down in Preston Beach in Devon, which is in Tor Bay, which consists of Torquay, Paynton and Brixham. And then we've got beaches in between. So I'm near a place called Preston Sands. Um, I've just come out for a new bike ride that I will be doing every morning before I go back to work, just trying to sort of get slightly fitter. And then I've got like a exercise regime that I'm doing at home, but I'm not gonna show you that because it does look absolutely ridiculous. I've done it twice and I've literally come back looking sweaty. Um, so yeah, um, I've just thought I'd also wanted to show you how amazing this place is first thing in the morning with the sun rising. It's absolutely stunningly beautiful. Um, I can't get enough of it. Just having to come down here just clears your mind. So yeah, so I just want to really touch on this video. Basically, um, if you've watched previous videos from a couple of years ago, you obviously know I suffer with m mental health issues, anxiety. So what I found recently, if I come out early in the morning, like I did yesterday, and just come sit by the beach and just breathe in the air and just watch the sunrise, it does clear your mind and I feel so much better for it. Um, I don't know, it's it's been different. And obviously I've done it again this morning. I've ridden down past literally no one out the seafront. And it is literally the best time to come in the summer, about half past four, five o'clock, just come down. If you do live in Devon, just come down to the sea run and just sit here for an hour. You know, you'll get the occasional people running and cycling, um, doing their ex early morning exercise like I'm doing. And it's just fantastic. Like, obviously behind me, this is towards Torquay and you've got Thatcher's Rock and just sort of that way in between there, we've got two like cruise ships at the moment. Um, that have docked in the bay and there's a couple of cargo ships and there's not really much happening normally you normally see boats in like fishing boats and um ferries going back and forth from Brixham to Tor Brixham to Torquay and then they stop over in the harbour sometimes pick some people up um but at the moment it's just it's just like this like why would you not want to live anywhere else I know I wouldn't right now um it's just amazingly beautiful I can't get enough of it um Right, so let's crack on. What's been going on with me? So obviously lockdown three months. I've been not working, I've been furloughed, but I am returning to work very, very soon, which is fantastic. I return back next week for a training session and then I officially go back in two days later um, to start my proper shifts again, which I can't wait. Some sort of normality back. Um, other fronts, uh, I have seen family and friends, obviously socially distant, and then Boris brought in the uh, restriction restriction lifted for people that live on their own and um, so i was able to form a social bubble with my mum so i've been staying over there sort of just you know just so i've got company and um, but if not i've just been seeing friends socially distant been out exercising um i started football with my friend jake uh we've done it once in the last two weeks and we should be doing it again today hopefully later on obviously when it's quietened down um what else have i been doing i've been doing hobbies i've been out i've did a couple of bits of photography i've been out some places but nothing major um, I've literally have been restricted to painting. I've not been anywhere else. I've been to Brixham briefly to see a seal in the harbour, which is Brixham is over there. Oh, hang on, I'm losing it. I'm losing it. Brixham sort of. No, Brixham's there on that peninsula because that's Berryhead right on the end there. So Berryhead's there, Brixham. So I've been there. Um, I haven't been that way to Torquay. I haven't been to Torquay for flipping ages. I haven't got out and actually walk through the shops I haven't since they've lifted the restrictions back on the 15th um yeah so with regards to my exercise I the funny story is I bought uh said bike three days before lockdowns lift uh being brought into place on the 23rd of March and the idea was I was going to cycle to work every night and every morning I want to do my afternoon shift back and forth to give me a bit more exercise but I got it and then the day like two days afterwards Boris has decided to announce that we can't you like obviously can't go to work so i lost all motivation but i did go on a couple of cycles in the evening like one that hardly anyone was around but even being out people were only went to get one form of exercise i was i've just seen people not adhering to the social distancing rules it's been crazy i'm not going to go into it because it's not my um i'm not here to get angry about it and get upset um yeah but now sort of everything's lifted now and then come 4th of July, I, I feel like we're going to be in a position where lockdown never existed. We're going back to some sort of normality and yeah, it's just going to be crazy. Um, even if you're not even if you're not paying attention to me, just admire the, the sunrise over it. It's just been lovely. 
so yeah i've got this bike so i've exercised i'm trying to exercise i've put on a little bit chubby weight that's my goal now is to uh start losing it secondly you're probably wondering what the how happened to the mop and the blonde locks um i had a little accident i was around i um decided to have a lot of down haircut uh i didn't do it obviously family did it for me but it hasn't come out too bad but I am longing for the day that my hairdresser reopens so I can get back in there and get this freaking thing sorted out because it is some of it is slightly longer than the other I don't want to lose the top it's around the back and the sides I've had to sort of like DIY it like see like you can see there and how different is this size so I've got to do something like that later but yeah it's been it's just been an absolute ball sort of yeah doing silly things recently lockdown makes you do haircuts it's oh I've learned I like cooking more that's one thing I've done in lockdown. I've cooked more for myself. In the night, I'm, I'm cooking meals, which is crazy. It's normally it's over takeouts, but yeah, because you're less mobile, your weight, you put more body weight on. Um, but it's been crazy. Yeah, I've, I've, I love cooking now, enjoying it. Um, I'm not more else to say, really. I'm just going to be waffling in this video. Sorry if my finger keeps going here because the camera's there and I sort of have to just hurt my arm when I'm holding it. So yeah, right. I'm going to wrap this vlog up and I'm going to head home. I'm going to get out of my sports attire, which is so fetching, obviously. Head home and cycle and uh, just get in and kit. Or I might just, what I will do is I'm going to cycle down to Paynton, back around half, not even, it's not even half a mile, it's not a quarter of a mile. Back around to Paynton Seafront and just probably just go and sit there on the beach. So before I was really interrupted by my phone deciding to stop recording, I was just going to say, um, if you follow me on Instagram or Facebook, um, I'll put the links below. Um, if you are watching this from my Facebook page onto YouTube, please subscribe because it doesn't work out. I've got 20 or 20, 30 followers on my Facebook page and only 12 subscribers, so something's not marrying up. I will put my Instagram back in. Um, I want to try and make this like a daily morning film where I just come down and I'll either just sit here and waffle by the beach and just talk, or I might go to somewhere different. I might try and go over to Paint and Harbour. I don't know. But yeah, thanks for watching, guys. Um, and what I'll do is I'll just leave you with a brief glimpse of Torbay in the morning so have fun keep safe and i will see you all very very soon